We're back. This is Stasis Hall. Different setup today. It's the wedding of Shruti and Vivek. They're on their way. People are coming through. We're just tidying up a bit. It's gonna be a wedding to remember. What's up, guys? My name is Kavish. I'm gonna be your MC. Let's show you the scenes. Absolutely beautiful, right? This is the status hall. Gotta tell you though, Vivek and Shruti, how did they meet? This started in Johannesburg. Now get this, he DM'd her online, I think it was Instagram, sends her this message. She was on the call with her mom at the time and she tells mom, hey, you know what? I just got a DM from a guy. And her mom was like, Shruti, you have to reply. If you don't reply, how will you ever find your Prince Charming? She laughed at the fact that Vivek is from India. <laughs> anyway, they exchange numbers, get to chatting. He sends her a voice note. She was taken away when she heard his voice. No accent. <laughs> and that's how they got together. They would then meet at the gym frequently, becoming friends, and then one thing led to another, and here we are. Newcastle, this is where they're getting married. Let's show you the rest of it. Sitting here, waiting to see you. Can't wait. Um, our day is finally here, and it's gonna be awesome. Love you. I'm not going to 
Hey, Vex family and friends, make some noise. All Shirty's family and friends, make some noise. It wasn't a competition. But we can see, yeah? You always came up here and let it put show up. Huh? Shout out family, that's what you're married into, right? <laughs> Alright, well, good to have you still here with us. Thank you so much for taking the time. Of course, it is a Saturday night. Of course, we've got Prakash Orchestra here. Yeah, I'm legends in the game. Of course, they're going to be entertaining us later on as well. We've got uh, some speakers coming up. We're also going to get to know these guys a bit better. And uh, we're going to get straight into it. My mom presented her to me and said, Arvind, this is your sister. Now, as a three-year-old, when someone gives you something and says it's yours, it belongs to you, right? So you feel possessive over it and love it and always take care of it because it's your favorite possession and it's been that way for most of my life. So growing up, it changed from a possession to the closest relationship I had. The bond between a big brother and a baby sister is only understood by us. Today, I have the privilege of exposing my brother's radiant features, darkest secrets and funniest moments. Just joking. <laughs> I know the most annoying thing one you can do is fall in choking in public. But for me, you'll always be my little brother, choking. <laughs> my brother Vivek, as we all know, is a kind, diligent, ambitious, and intelligent individual who's always placed great love in our family's name. And for that, we are all proud of you. So don't, don't feel shy now, okay? We need to ask this question. You guys, you guys are married now, right? I want to ask this. Who went in on the first kiss? Yeah! He's here, yeah, he's family there. <laughs> so who was the first to say the words, I love you? Yeah! Ooh, he had it all planned out, this guy, right? Listen, you guys are married now, so we need to know. Who is the pants in this relationship? Both of them! Both of them! Both of them! There we go, alright. Now listen, married couples over here, you guys know sometimes okay, we have to balance things out in the relationship, right? So, let's ask them, now that you guys are married, who is going to be doing the cooking? Both of them! Both of them! Mm. Then I, I need to know, who's the better cook? I'm the better cook! Okay. Now that you guys are married, who's going to be doing the washing of the dishes? Vivek is like, I'm going to buy a dishwasher. <laughs> Who's going to be doing the laundry? <laughs> Who's going to be buying the groceries? <laughs> Who's going to be taking out the trash? Vivek! Yeah. Well, role there, alright. Who's the first to start an argument? <laughs> Okay, okay, next question, right? Who's the first to finish the argument? Who says sorry first? Yeah. He's like, he's like, he's like, he's like, he's like, he's like Who shouts more? <laughs> Who has the crazier bunch of friends? Uh, should these friends make some noise? I have to deal with that part. <laughs> and the last question, we've got two families coming together here. Who has the crazier family? Let's go, Alright, give them a big round of applause, that was always shooting. My uncle for me has always been akin to that of a guardian, a mentor, 
and a teacher, and was responsible for my intellectual development on many levels. And so I owe many of my qualities and achievements to him. He, in union with my Nani, taught me how to read. He broadened my creativity and acted as a, my first alma mater of sorts by introducing me to computers, digital encyclopedias, and video games from a very tender age. He shielded my naughty self-mindings when I absolutely deserved it. And most importantly, something that no human being can do without, he potty trained me. As far back as I can remember, Amisha loved dancing. And if memory serves me correct, we used to go into the library's activity hall and practice and learn many dances, even when we knew we weren't going in. It was our favorite way to pass time. Amisha, till date, is one of the friendliest, kindest, and one of the most beautiful people that I know. Well, let's go! Watch, go! Shoe, go! A man's coat, go! I promise to love you today, tomorrow, and for all the days of my life, and to, to be your constant companion and your true love, now and forevermore. I love you, Shruti. Thank you. What a vibe the past two days here at Newcastle. Absolutely love it. Vivek, Shruti, all the best for your married life. Thank you for having events to remember. Capture your most magical memories. I'm out of here, guys. Back to Durban. See you when I see you.